Ladies and gentlemen, what's up? What's going on, guys? My name is Jack the Bus. You can call me I Shinobi. Welcome back to a brand new video. Today we have episode 17 of our Jujutsu Kaisen watcher named Kyoto Sisters Cool Exchange Event Group Battle 3. It looks like this the title of this episode finally changes next episode. Thank God. Now, guys, last episode was probably my favorite of the series so far. We got to see Panda versus Mechamaru. And we learned a lot about both of those characters during the fight. Panda being more of like an advanced puppet from the principal, not actually a panda. And Mechamaru kind of acting in a similar way being controlled by someone else this frail dude who has to sit in this room where like the moonlight can't even touch him because it would break his bones there's a really hard hitting backstory and kind of caught me off guard now last episode kind of teased that this episode we would see maki and miwa face off this episode so i guess we'll find out guys just before we start if you're new to the channel drop a sub hit that big wood bell so you miss any future episodes if i like on this one let's just hop right into it she sees miwa yeah that's what i thought okay she was like, dang it, this girl got an ego. <laughs> or is she Miwa? No, she's Miwa, Maki. I forget her name with the shorter hair. Oh my god! She's only fourth grade? Hey, she's showing that she doesn't need any powers like that. She, she's that strong with just tools and weapons. God dang. You're gonna kill her, bro? My god! Simple domain! Oh, shoot? What? Oh, that's why she was so impressed by Isidori dodging it. Huh. Oh my gosh, wait, that's sick. That, like, turns on aimbot in, like, a specified area. EI Jutsu. Oh, she got a long spear. Why? Oh! But if, it, yeah, if you missed, then, then what? Oh my gosh, she ain't wasted any time, bro! Why you don't mess around? Aikido. She gap closed the gap! さっさと二級にでも。ああ、そうか。僕もそう思ってるんだけど、全員家が邪魔してるくさいね。素直に手のひら返して認めてやりゃいいのにさ。金以外の死柄は理解できない。パワー。相変わらずの主戦度ね。
output is in like just the wind in general would it like tear her apart yeah we still haven't seen you know the full extent of him ah they gotta stay on their toes for him she had to you know reserve a certain amount of cursed energy Dude, no wonder she's so, like, tightly strong, bro. That is so sad. I'd be a dick, too. Yeah, but she's still just trying to kind of get in her head. This is still a competition. Also... Yeah, she does kind of treat people. Mm. Oh. Okay. Yeah, wait, that's true, isn't it? They, they, they were raised together, so... And Maki's not, like, super ego. What? Is that all cursed energy? Oh my god! She was just setting marks? Wait, no but a five head, bro! She got a She got a piece of it. Does that matter? Yeah, she that's all she needed. Oh the struggle! But would the would the broom be connected to her though? I don't remember exactly how the straw doll worked. Is it just a piece of them? Because wouldn't that be separate, a separate entity? No, what a so cool man. I just love the whole hammer and nails. Oh, she was taking down the broom, not her. Huh, very smart. What? Oh, it's like less than the blow so she doesn't kill her, but still do a lot. Oh, let's go! Dude, you can't just third party that, man. That's so lame. Of course she's the one to show up. Of course. These third parties, man, it's so lame. Let them 1v1. She won! Very clearly! Better have been. <laughs> yeah, he's not doing great. That is so unfair, dude. Dude, she's so badass, though. She just don't care. She's gonna win. Look, a gun is so cheap, too. Unless she uses it in a cool way. <laughs> I'm glad she brought up Maki. She's like, she was raised the same way. She'll be mad no matter how I answer. It's more of an intimidation thing. Like a respect thing. Instead of her being actually mean. I don't know. It's the way she handles like the staff is so cool. An annoying clan. Yeah, they do sound like an annoying clan. The way they run things. Ah. That's why they're they're both fighting pretty hard. <laughs> Whole conversation about her. <laughs> She got that's why she's play, like I said, she probably always plays the win, but there's some passion in, in this now. She sliced the boy! Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Fall right into her freaking kick, bro. Rejected from birth. Rejected from the very beginning. That is so sad. Oh, the curse. And she can't see it. God. Well, she like bravely led her by because she can't see it anyways. That's a gross looking curse. I low-key want her to come back and, like, kill this dude one day. She gonna take him out, bro! 
Why is he exactly how I pictured him to look? She's just sitting there. Dang, dude. This show is way too good about, like, at fleshing out these side characters. It's insane. They get, like, whole backstories every episode. I wonder if she holds resentment towards both of them being, or like towards, you know, my being connected to Maki's abandonment of this clan. So she feels she holds her responsible inherently. Even though, like I said, they were both rejected from the very beginning. Let me know if, I, if I'm wrong in that sense, but that's how I'm kind of interpreting it. She also only needs one really good shot, but she's so fast. And she's... She's out of shots, yeah. She counted the bullets, baby! Oh, a secret. Oh. What? Where is it in the magazine? My first love. She put another boy in the in the chamber? She creates matter. Yeah, she just put another one in with this technique after she had already fired one. Oh my gosh. Oh, so that's it. Yeah, she's... If that doesn't work out, it, it's used up, but... Oh, because the revolver, yeah, obviously has six shots. Unless she can... Catch it, I guess? <laughs> Bro, I trust her with my life. Actually. Oh my god. Oh, she's just desperate now. She has nothing left. And they are paying off. My goodness. I guess it's not a life to her. She wanted to bring her to the top with her. She said, Onicha, call me that. Yeah. She was leaving, so she was taking her to the top with her. Damn. Called her a liar again. Dude, this show is is rough, man. It's such intense fights, such sad, traumatic backstories. It's hard to keep up. Oh. Well, now we have seen the defeat of Mai in this group battle. It seems like it's going really good for Itadori's side of things, especially since he has Toto on basically on his team now. We didn't even see the end of that fight. I feel like it kind of set things up for it to kind of like loop back at the end. Like I said, this is the last episode that starts with like group battle events. So I'm guessing it's going to slowly transition next episode maybe pivoting towards them actually exercising this curse that they need to or more people trying to take a stand and actually kill itadori but like i said i mean he seems pretty fine all of his class is still up panda's already off exercising bro but guys that has been it for episode 17 of our jujitsu kaisen watch through let me know what you thought of the episode down in the comments below and as always i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day as per usual and i'll catch you in the next one peace peace